I've spent the past few weeks using both Base44 and Lovable, and they honestly serve very different purposes, but I wanted to see which one actually holds up better when building real-world projects. Base44, which feels a lot like tools such as Windsurf or Blackbird, is focused on developer productivity. It's built for coders, offering things like automated API generation, open API spec mocking, test environments, and even debugging integrations, all enhanced by AI. When I used it, I was genuinely impressed. I started with a rough open API draft, and Base44 actually filled in the gaps, flagged errors, and spun up a testable mock server in under 15 minutes, complete with live URLs I could send to a front-end dev. It was seamless, and I didn't have to jump between Postman, Swagger, or a separate deployment pipeline. It just worked. Meanwhile, Lovable is more like Hostinger Horizons or AppSmith. It's designed to take an idea and turn it into a working, styled web app instantly. I tried it by typing build me a gym class booking app, and within five minutes it had created a full, mobile-ready front end with basic logic. No hosting hassles, no code needed, and it even gave me a domain preview. I tested Lovable by building three separate projects, a customer dashboard, a food delivery MVP, and a travel itinerary tool, and it did shockingly well with UI and flow, but each time I hit a wall once I needed deeper logic like API integrations, custom user auth, or conditional workflows. In contrast, Base44 didn't do any front-end stuff, but absolutely nailed everything back-end related. I felt like I had superpowers when mocking, generating, and testing APIs. It understood the spec, produced clean code, and let me debug or reset test environments instantly. Lovable made me feel fast, like I was prototyping ideas without friction, while Base44 made me feel like I was building something solid and ready for production. The difference really comes down to who you are. If you're a developer or engineer looking to ship reliable infrastructure or API tools quickly, Base44 is the clear choice. If you're a non-coder, startup founder, or someone who needs to ship an MVP or design prototype yesterday, then Lovable will get you there faster. I'd never use Lovable for a production-ready app without adding a real backend under it, but for testing an idea or showing something off to clients, it's perfect. Meanwhile, Base44 is what I'd use on actual projects, especially where APIs, collaboration, and testing matter. In short, if you're code first, go with Base44. If you're idea first, use Lovable.